Hello there, Internet. My name is White Dragons, and welcome back to Purgatory. So, I think when we last left off, I was trying to come to a decision on what to do next. Uh, unfortunately, in this mod pack, it's not completely done yet. And I do apologize for the birds in the background, but as always, you currently died 15 times. Kiss my ass. Actually, hold on. I was... I have starvation. Yes, this is true. I died by monster. Yes unknown so I've died by one starvation and by monster okay I can live with that so anyways thank god we're not in hardcore mode no I want that I want this so unfortunately I wish the quest book would be a little bit let me get the hell out of the rain what the hell am I doing um unfortunately the quest book is not completely done yet as far as this mod pack is concerned so uh we're left with a kind of like a drawback here so what I've done is, is I've went ahead and I've done some extra little things along the way, like a lunch bag and a lunch box, for example. And you can see them right here. Now, to make the lunch bag, you're going to need to make raw plastic. And I need to show you how to make raw plastic so you understand. So if you have a regular furnace, you can go over or rec any type of furnacing or smelting device. And you first need to, uh, and unfortunately I didn't grab any, raw rubber once you smelt raw rubber you get rubber bars then you're going to need to smelt the rubber bar into raw plastic so you then you'll have you know like boom raw plastic now if we take the raw plastic and we re is it no wait hold on hold on hold on i had this all down pat no that's the lunch bag i don't care about the lunch bag Raw plastic. Okay. I'm trying to remember how I did this, because this like, like blew my mind. I'm trying to figure this out. Was it? Did I put it in here? Yes. Okay. So raw plastic you put into your ter your uh, crafting table, and then you get plastic sheets. Okay. So then you can take plastic sheets, and uh, where is it at? Here it is. You can take plastic sheets, and you, the way you make a plastic bag, if I hit R, you know, it's not going to show. Okay. So I actually go back, and if I go back into my inventory, uh, let's see. I think I was going to do this one on camera so you guys could see it. Um, plastic. I mean, this stuff is, it's not complicated. If you played Agrarian Skies, oh shit, it's pretty easy, but it's just a real pain in the ass. You're going to need string and one, two, three, four, five, six pieces of plastic. And unfortunately, you only get four per turn. So uh, basically, you're going to need to melt about three bars of rubber, I think, in order to get it. And birds in the background. God damn it. I really love them. But I really hate them sometimes. Ooh, I can't do that yet. I mean, while I'm waiting on that, let me go get the string from downstairs. Uh, not very much has changed. I did go ahead and patch up some holes and whatnot uh, from our last episode. Um, I'm kind of thinking of just expanding this whole thing out and probably living underneath the house instead of like last episode. I think I talked about making like a star or space station or something like that. I still want to do that, but what I would really like to do is kind of make like a separate space station for separate things maybe like um i don't know a mob grinder or something so that way we don't have an accidental um chunk load uh oh i need to make shit i need to do no what the hell was i thinking you're gonna have to make you're gonna have to smell four rubber, rubber bars to get four raw plastics that's what i meant to say earlier i'm stupid Stupid, 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 stupid. Anyways, um, so I don't know yet. I'm still thinking about that. Uh, also, uh, I went ahead and made the food journal. And the way you make the food journal... Oh, get that out of here. I don't want that. Where's the food journal at? There it is. Uh, food journal. Make the food journal with wheat and one piece of paper. And you get the piece of paper, obviously, from... Well, apparently you can shape craft it. Or you can just use sugar cane, which is what I did. I guess this is sawdust, so yeah. Yeah, <clears throat> you can get sawdust and water and get two, or just go straight across and get three. I'm not 100% sure how that system works, but eh, go with the exchange, whatever. Alright, so that should be done. Okay, now we have four. 
and we're gonna make that all right so we now we need one here one here one here one here one here the click system doesn't work for some reason so like you know like if you want to go look it up and you're like oh man I could just easily fix I could easily do that and then you go uh, and then you hold shift and click what the hell man I've been trying to do compressed cobblestone and I guess I'm screwing up on something I don't know anyway so we got three plastic bags yay for us how exciting so let's go ahead and open up so now we have this one and then the ne next one is the knapsack which knapsack's not very difficult to do um, it's just gonna require that you have a forge now oh, nap not not too difficult but we're gonna need leather and we're gonna need a gold bar or aluminum brass now the leather does uh, there's no way to actually get leather unless you kill cows so that one's actually gonna have to wait till we can get um, until we can find something. I have yet to find a freaking Enderman around here. Totally pissing me off. Anyways, uh, I did claim this reward already, which was, of course, a starfish jelly sandwich. Uh, let's go ahead and claim this one, which is two coconuts. Uh, let's go ahead and claim our bag, which is another starfish. Uh, starfruit, sorry, starfish. Starfruit jelly sandwich. And... I also want you to read this. Okay, the lunch box works. The lunch box works the same way as a lunch bag. It just carries more food. If you hear a little squeak, don't worry. It only happened 502 times. So apparently, this thing's durability is only 502 times. And from what I can understand, from what I can understand is I can actually take this device uh, and put it in my uh, in my hotbar here and then right click and then I can put food in uh, like much much like the lunch bag here and apparently you can only do singles maybe maybe singles I don't know so the lunch box is open and if I close it so I'm guessing this is another system for uh, for automatic eating maybe I don't know I'm not 100% sure here this is pretty weird. I've never had to deal with that one, with that type before. I just never did that. I also did the chisel block, um, the chisel um, one, which was basically you get 16 marble. And the way you do a chisel is very easy. Uh, basically, it's a piece of iron and a stick. And that's where you get the extra sticks from. So the iron, uh, the uh, oh, it's a full, it's a, it's a full moon. Nothing crazy's happening, huh? interesting anyways um what was i saying uh the chisel will be used to redo a lot of these cobblestone blocks you have here uh so we've got that one done this is probably my next one and unfortunately these chanted books kind of concern me a little bit because they may or may not be good stuff so i don't know if i have a hunt all the all the iron i need to do this and uh, last episode, of course, we looked over how to create slime uh, things. Um, my food journal. That's so weird how this thing works. So uh, I guess like sometimes like this thing. OK, if you look at it, it has a passive ability, which gives me plus 2.5 hearts. OK, it converts to emeralds when you drop it. Well, if we don't if we die, our stuff goes into a grave, right? A, a tombstone so we'll never drop it so I'm guessing it's gonna stay like that so I'm very cautious with that thing right now oh oh hello hello dear sir can I interest you in in something plus five I got a better weapon all right here we go come on come on bro oh there you are come here Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. No! Okay, this, I gotta lure him out. Come on, bro. Come on. No, I really need your ender pearl. Please. Please, no. No! <laughs> He's gotta be around here. Damn it. I need that ender pearl, guys. We need it so desperately. 
for the quest. Get up there, White. He's, he's not, is he around here? Maybe. Damn it, we need that ender pearl. This is the second time an enderman has come into the house and I have not been able to kill it. That's angering me very much. Oh, I don't see this enderman anywhere. Maybe he's down here? What the hell is that? What's that green thing? What is this? Is this a slime? Are you serious? Is this what's been making all the noise around my house? Nope. Because this thing is silent mode. Huh. I will kill it. Get, get out of here. Get out of here. Get, I, I really need you. Actually, no. I need you guys because I want to make enough to be able to make a slime, a slime farm eventually. And that's going to be pretty difficult. Thank you. Damn it. Where is this Enderman at? Oh. By the way, we can now do diamond. Oh, glorious diamond. Look at that. Get that diamond. Oh, yeah. You like that diamond, huh? You like that diamond, huh? Yeah, yeah. You're not going to use it. I don't know what we could use it for, anyways. So... Damn it. I need that Enderman, people. Make it happen. Alright, so anyways, like I was saying before, um, I'm kind of at a dead still right now. Uh, I know I can make the armor. And I need to go back over to that castle place, that castle that's across the way, our neighbors, and kind of rob them of everything at this point. Um, because I think I can harvest it now. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I think I can harvest it. And that would be really awesome if I could. It would also be really awesome if I could kill a damn Enderman. Because the Ender IO mod in this thing is super awesome. Super awesome. Um, I was really, really... I mean, we got slime. I mean, that's, a, that's kind of a good thing. Uh, but again... The ender eye is just an awesome 19. I don't think that's going to be enough. So we'll just take half of this. And, oh, I don't even have to do that, do I? I can just manually put it in there. And it'll just... Yes. Uh, so anyways, uh, like I was talking about before, I could go ahead and make a block and go ahead and get some of this stuff done. I want to go ahead and enchant this stuff. Uh, I've got 35 XP and I really don't want to lose it. That is flipping annoying. That is so frippling annoying. There's no way to stop it. What the hell is that that's going outside? What in the behemoth hell is that? That is like driving through like it's going to shoot me or something. What the hell is a tractor coming down here jeez Louise hold on I'll be right back <laughs> 